Hi guys, it's Henry Sable and welcome back to another video. Today's video is going to help me with increasing my speed. Goalkeepers need to have explosive speed when coming out for free balls or getting across the goal. Hopefully this is going to help me with that. So let's see what we've got in this bag. This is the Precision Training Resistant Parachute. Got it on. So I'm going to time myself sprinting five times. 30 metres down the end of the garden, see what my best time is and then compare that to running without the parachute. Hopefully the resistance of the parachute will make me a lot faster without it. Three, two, one, go. By the way guys, the wind is against me here. My first time was 7.79 seconds. Sprint number two. Three, two, one, go. You can really feel the parachute dragging and pulling on you. Anyway, my second time was 7.18 seconds. An improvement. Sprint three. Three. Two, one, go. That time I felt it was better and it was 6.8 seconds. Sprint four, the second to last sprint. Three, two, one, go. must have peaked in the middle because this one was 7.13 seconds. This is the last sprint with the parachute. Three, two, one, go. I couldn't stop myself there at the end. I ran into the hedge and I think I broke it. I heard a cracking noise. So the time on that one was 6.63 seconds. That is a pretty good time I think. If you think this parachute is sick then hit that like button. So this is going to be the first sprint without the parachute. Obviously I'm going to be faster but the question is how much faster? Three, two, one, go. quite a bit easier if I'm honest because I was almost expecting the parachute to be there but it wasn't and like oh I feel like I'm faster now do you know what I mean and I was I got 6.11 seconds obviously there's an element of me getting tired here but I am having about a minute rest in between so sprint two here we go three two one go that time was actually faster the time is 6.33 though so it was only it's only a few zero point seconds out so it's close sprint number three here we go three two one go the time then was 6.49 seconds weirdly right now my time is going up but when I was doing the parachute my time was going down I think it's just me getting tired though sprint four three two one 
go. I felt faster that time. And the time was 6.03. Oh my God, guys, I might be able to get below six seconds. I'm gonna put a bit of a longer rest in between this one and the last one. So hopefully that helps me be quicker. So guys, final spin. I'm trying to get below six seconds. 5.99, be happy with it. Let's do it. Three, two, one, go. So unfortunately, I was slower that time. My time was 6.21 seconds. My target now is to get below six seconds without the parachute. So I'll keep practicing with the parachute. And hopefully the resistance will make me stronger and that'll make me quicker. I'll leave a link below where you can buy the Precision GK training parachute. Thanks for watching the video guys. If you did enjoy, then hit that like button and subscribe for more. Bye. Bye guys.